When you date a woman from the Bronx, you need to be mindful that she's tough and she's strong and she's independent. She's been outside a long time. She's been outside a long time in pajama pants. You need to keep her pajama pants budget unlimited because she likes to walk outside in pajama pants and Jordans. The key to a woman from the Bronx heart is new pajama pants. She's been outside with scars on fighting all her life. She had to fight. She's I'm going to deck tough. your mother. She's Keep a playing tough woman. With me. So when you deal with her, you need to be tough too. She got four razor blades in her pocket, a scalpel, and all types of stuff, just in case, still to this day. Because she might see a girl that she fought 10 years ago that she beat on, and that girl want beef again. She don't like weak dudes. She don't like nobody that she's dating and be weak. So when you with a woman from the Bronx, you got to be strong. You got to be confident because she going to smell it if you're not confident. She going to know. She's a different type of woman. She's a different breed. So she's going to know if you're not confident. Just some facts about dating a Bronx woman. She's going to take your eighth. <laughs> Hide your eighth. If you got an eighth around a Bronx woman, it's gone. She's going to put it in one backwood, sprinkle it with mad guava, and that's it. Your eighth is gone. She's going to roll it in two blunts. So if you're going to be dating a Bronx woman, you need to have a lot of Zaza. Have a lot of Zaza. All right? Or she's not even going to talk to you. You ain't rolling up. You need to be rolling up every five minutes you dating a woman from the Bronx. You ain't rolling up. She gonna look at you like, why you ain't rolling up? And then she gonna smack you in the back of your head. Because when you dating a woman from the Bronx, you need to understand it. She got hands. Her hands always work. Her hands are always working. Even in her sleep, her hands is working. She will wake up in her sleep and fight her dreams. If Freddy Cougar pull up in a Bronx woman's oh, dreams, yeah. Freddy Cougar better rush. She's already there waiting in her dreams while her hands ready. She knew Freddy Cougar was coming. A Bronx chick is always ready to square up. She's going to want to fight you. Her love language is her hands. So when you're dealing with a Bronx woman and you get her upset, there will be blood. There will be violence. They're amazing. Women from the Bronx, that's where hip-hop started. They full of culture. They full of life. And so you need to have a certain level of confidence when you're dating a woman from the Bronx. Because she's not just going to be talking to anybody. She don't let nobody talk to her crazy, especially not you, bro. And you always broke. You always broke. I don't care if y'all get married and y'all been married for 20 years. She's still going to call you bro. I know every woman say, I'm going to fight you, but a bronze woman is going to fight you. So don't play with a bronze woman, all right? She got a big heart, and that big heart, she'll beat you with it.